There are hours upon hours of audio with instances where Amber admits to physically f***ing Johnny, and many more instances that demonstrate her desire to continue conflict. We cannot work it out if you run away to the bathroom every time. Listen to me. Listen to me. And Johnny's desire to retreat. A boxer can't go 12 rounds without a fucking minute break. I'm not not giving you a minute break. You do it at minute three at the beginning of an argument. No. Amber and Johnny's couple therapist, Laurel Avis Anderson, reveals the main tactic Amber used to keep Johnny in fights. I know she led on more than one occasion and started it to keep him with her because abandonment and having him leave was her worst nightmare. The second one is what she reported to me, which is if he was going to leave her to de-escalate from the fight, she would strike him to keep him there. She would rather be in a fight than have him leave. I don't want to instigate any fights. I do not want to fight anymore. Ms. Hurd had a Jack Hammer style of talking. She was very amped up. He had trouble talking at a similar pace. I wish I'd bought into the months of you review. I wish I'd bought into the problems. I wish I'd I could have kids with you. You're a yourself. I wish I'd bought into any of the lies you told. Talk about fake really good. Because I was a fake ass baby with love. You're the biggest fucker. A fake really good. Talk about presenting yourself as a good one. You're the fake you, you, you left nothing and I left everything. It was a sound that I got very used to. The, the raising of the voice to excommunicate anything that I had to say about uh, the situation. Did you ever hear Amber Heard yell at Mr. Depp? Yes. On how many occasions? I couldn't tell you the number of occasions. He was cut off a lot, and so he was really overwhelmed. When you start to fight you know, fucking gets crazy. It's fucking crazy, you know, and th that that makes me not feel, uh, for lack of a better word, safe. Yeah, I mean, lots of name calling, lots of f bombs, a lot of, you know. Who was the name calling directed at? So that was typically Miss Heard directing her feelings toward Mr. Depp. What do you recall Miss Heard saying in those instances? Oh dear. It would vary, and to be honest, I, I tried to not pay attention. I was just there to get Mr. Depp out of there, but there were times I've heard Miss Heard call him a <laughs> washed up, <laughs> deadbeat dad, <laughs> hunt, you name it. She, she's spewed it. But Amber appears to flip the abuser and the victim roles in the legal proceedings. In the private audios, one of her main complaints to Johnny is that he escapes from fights. But every time you don't like what I say and you run away, we'll never work out anything. You can't run away every fight. But in the legal proceedings, she insists that she's the one who escapes. Did you just tell Johnny Depp in that recording that I remember hitting you as a response to the door thing? Yes, as he was trying to get into the door, I was trying into the room. I was trying to escape in. If she admits to hitting him with a door in private, in the deposition, she's the one who was hit while trying to escape from him. I was trying to escape in. He pushed the door into me, and I was trying to hit him by getting out of, by getting him out of the door to stay in the room. I'm really sorry about hitting you with the door, about uh, hitting your head. I did not mean to. She kicked uh, the bathroom door into my head. And I'm really sorry about hitting you with the door, about uh, hitting your head. I did not mean to, nor. You didn't mean to hit me in the head with the door, but you meant to I didn't. punch me in the jaw. I meant to hit you 